After years of work and months of teasing, Bollinger Motors has unveiled its B1 all-electric sport utility truck in its home state of New York. The first thing anyone will notice about the B1 won't be its newfangled electric powertrain, but rather its old-school looks, which includes a classic three-box design. It rides high, and its big mud tires immediately signal that this vehicle has off-road capability, while its minimalist styling and flat surfaces speak to its utility. Inside, the B1 has sealed gauges and polyurethane-coated floor pans. If the interior gets dirty, and we suspect it will, it can simply be hosed down. The B1 is powered by either a 60 or 100 kWh battery pack A and a pair of electric motors providing 360 horsepower and 472 pound-feet of torque. It's surprisingly quick, doing 0-60 miles per hour in just 4.5 seconds. The 60 kilowatt hour pack offers 120 miles of driving range and charges in 7.3 hours on a level 2 charger, or 45 minutes on a DC fast charger. The 100 kilowatt hour pack offers 200 miles of range, and recharges in 12.1 hours, level 2, or 75 minutes, DC fast charger. The B1 uses the Chadmo charging standard. Estimated fuel economy is a combined 67.4 miles per gallon equivalent. With Bollinger's first vehicle, the emphasis is on utility, and the electric powertrain is part of that. With front and rear motors, the B1 is all-wheel drive, and its combination of torque and ground clearance, adjustable from 10 to 20 inches, mean that is will make itself at home on or off the road. The B1 features a self-leveling four-wheel independent suspension, and disconnecting anti-roll bars to allow for maximum articulation off-road. A set of BF Goodrich LT285-70R17 mud terrain tires provides traction. Since the B1 is an all-electric truck, it's really a portable energy source, says Bollinger Motors CEO Robert Bollinger. For work in the field, the B1 offers a number of power outlets including a pair of 110-volt plugs in the back of the truck. The vehicle also offers several storage areas, including a 14-cubic-foot frunk, and a rear cargo area that can accommodate 72 half-inch sheets of drywall with the rear seats removed. A pass-through stretching from the rear bed to the frunk makes more room for longer items, and can fit 24 2x4s at lengths of up to 12 feet with the tailgate closed. The B1 can also tow 6,100 pounds. Bollinger says it will release pricing later this year, and is still working to secure manufacturing in the U.S. Once that is finalized, Bollinger expects to begin deliveries of the B1 in 19 months.